And now, your live Doppler 18 forecast with meteorologist Sarah McKenna. Weather from where you live. And good morning. We are continuing to see clear conditions right now. As far as the sky cover goes, as you take a look across satellite and radar, we're not seeing too much activity, although we do have a little bit of fog this morning that we are dealing with. Something to keep in mind as you step out the door. As for those temperatures, we're down in the 40s now. 49 degrees right now in Lafayette. We're seeing 46 into Fort Wayne, 54 Chicago, 51 Terre Haute. Evansville, though, still into the 60s, 67 degrees, so really a pretty big temperature gradient between Evansville and Fort Wayne as we take a look just across to Indiana. Now here's a look. We are one degree away from tying our record set back in 1956, so it really has been a while since we've seen temperatures quite this cool. Our average is at 62 degrees. We already talked about how well below we are from that average temperature. Our high, 84 degrees. We're expecting our temperatures to stay a little bit below that. Not by too much, though. Here's a look at what's going on. Satellite and radar showing you a little bit of those rain showers down near this border of Indiana and Kentucky. For us, however, clear conditions. And as you take a look further off to the west, you notice the clear conditions are expected to stick around. High pressure's in control for us, and that does mean that we tend to see clear skies or maybe just a few thin clouds. So for today, a cool morning, obviously, as we are now into the 40s. But overall, another sunny day, up to 79 degrees for your high. Today is going to be very similar to yesterday. Tonight, perfect football weather. If you're going to be out at any of the games, clear, cool, and calm conditions. 53 degrees for your low. Grab a jacket if you are planning on going out. Then for tomorrow, if you're going to the Purdue game, Perfect weather for that as well. 79 for the high, lots of sunshine, a great day, whether it's the Purdue game or any other outdoor activities you have, a great day to get outside and really enjoy. Taking a look at the rest of your seven-day forecast, you can see that Saturday kind of ends the chance of having those beautiful, just sunny, gorgeous days. And we're going to see rain, which in some people's eyes are also beautiful mm -hmm. days, but by a complete different definition. We're going to see those rain chances starting on Sunday, and they last.